dear Valve. Why? Oh boy, uh, that's gonna be a very emotional one for sure. Um, where do I even begin? You see, Team Fortress 2 is a game that will always hold a special place in my heart. I've been playing this game since I was 13 years old, and I played this game for over 4,000 hours, read the comics, still waiting for the final part by the way, and I have spent a ton of money on this game, eventually getting into trading. Even though I had my faces where I didn't touch this game for multiple weeks or even months, eventually I always returned back to this game. It went with me through good times and bad times. As much as I love this game with every cell of my body, it pains me to see the mistreatment this game is receiving from its developers. I don't mean the people who still work on TF2. I'm very sure that they are doing a great job and I am very grateful for their efforts. I'm talking about the company itself. And I'm not even talking about the lack of major updates, seriously, I could live without that, but I'm talking about the lack of playability this game has due to the recent bot crisis. And with recent, I mean, more than two years, I mean, come on Valve. Look, we can't convince the bot hosts to stop what they're doing, they're a waste of sperm anyway, but Valve, this is a multi-billion dollar company with almost unlimited resources and TF2 still being a profitable game through the community market, the man's co store, etc. Honestly, I don't get it. It's almost like Valve is intentionally killing TF2. For example, through the muting of free plays, discouraging a bunch of new players from playing this game and other methods that, in all honesty, didn't help the situation at all. Then again, why are they still posting content updates on Smithmas and Halloween that are actually very decent? This doesn't add up. Yeah, I know that TF2 doesn't gain nearly as much money as CSGO or Dota. Still, a lot of people continue paying a good amount of money for this game. So the least thing that Valve owes us is a functioning product. They shouldn't expect us to pay for nearly released cases with the cosmetics even made by the community while their actual product being broken. Like, why? I don't get it. Team Fortress 2 has so much potential, having one of the largest, loyal and resilient community in the world. Yet, this game is getting so neglected in a way that it is almost unplayable now. I think by now you should see my point of view. This situation may look bad, but there's still hope. I haven't posted this video just to rant at Valve and to let out some of my collected emotions. No, it is mostly because I want to raise awareness on this recently announced peaceful protest on the 26th of March 2022. This is a community event with the goal that Valve puts more resources into fixing the spot problem. Among other things, this protest is made in the form of a video where content creators, no matter how big or small, show their love and appreciation towards this game. Maybe, just maybe, this will be enough for Valve to see that TF2 still has a dedicated community. Maybe then they will see that the TF2 community deserves more attention. Or alternatively, their image gets damaged and they will have to fix this problem, otherwise their monetary gains from other games will suffer because of that tarnished image they now have. But we shouldn't get into that. To conclude, this video is made to show my support towards this movement and to contribute my share to it. I'm sorry if I was a little emotional at some point, but I feel like I just had to let it out at some point. Anyway, stay healthy, stay safe, don't jump out of the window, and I wish you a very, very good day.